The law in Ireland around online child abuse first started in 1998 with the publication of the Child Trafficking and Pornography Act. This piece of legislation deals with all aspects of abusing children online and with abusing children in real life as well in many cases. It is divided into three separate sections primarily that deal with child exploitation, with the possession of child abuse images and with the distribution and production of child abuse images. The fourth section deals with child sexual exploitation, which is the whole area of grooming, online grooming, procuring children for acts online or involving children in child prostitution. The maximum sentence for child exploitation is 20 years. This whole area deals very effectively with individuals that will engage in any type of online act. And this is the legislation we primarily use in our cases. The next piece of legislation is the possession of child sexual abuse material. This comes with a penalty of five years that will be given to individuals as a maximum for possessing any imagery they have of children that is sexually exploitive or sexually explicit. The other piece of legislation is the distribution and production of child pornography. So anyone that is involved in distributing this material, whether on the internet or by any other means, through messaging or anything like that, or through producing it, where they film children involved in sexually explicit acts, or they take pictures of children who are exposed. This also carries a severe penalty of 14 years in this case. New laws will always come online. The new Harassment and Harmful Communications Act 2020 increases our effectiveness against these type of criminals. And as we go into the future, new laws will be created and enhance our ability to investigate, detect and prevent criminals who would be involved in the abuse of children.